Hi guys. So, um, I just came out of second day. I didn't do my update for after we came out yesterday. So this is second day of nursing school. Um, and the reason I didn't update yesterday was just because um, there was a lot of information thrown at us. And by the time I got home and uh, then got my son from football and everything, <laughs> I was exhausted. So um, it was just a lot of information. And so today was the second first day because um, we had a new set of classes, of course, and um, it went really well. I have really great instructors that um, on these set of classes I think are going to be great. Um, and then, of course, um, we got out. Like, it's, what time is it right now? 10 o'clock? Let me look. Yeah, it's 10.30. <laughs> Yay! Um, and we're out of class. So, um, now, of course, I still have my online classes that I have to do, so um, it would be like <clears throat> a little break and then going back into another class um, if we were doing in-person on this. So, the good thing about having um, the online classes that is, is that, you know, in case something happens with the pandemic that we are in, that those classes will still continue. It won't upset that. So that's a very positive thing because um, it's it's kind of borderline right now as to whether or not, you know, what's going to happen if all the schools shut down again and, you know, are we going to have to, like, restart the program, which is a possibility. Um, and it's like, I just made it this far. <laughs> Please don't, please don't let that happen. Um, they're going to try to do everything within their power to not let that happen for us. Um, but, you know, it could happen. And, of course, nobody can help it because it's a pandemic. So, um, I'm in my car right now. Sorry, you guys. It's kind of... <laughs> um, anyway, so second day of nursing school. This was a lot of fun. And um, we did the fundamentals of nursing. Some people call it basics of nursing. Um, and, you know, I was, like, trying to be on top of my game. I had all of chapter one, you know, all my Anki cards made. And, you know, I had already gone over and reviewed. And <laughs> that was ridiculous. We started inside of chapter 14. So now I'm kind of stressing because I'm behind the times a little bit because I don't have anything from chapter 14. Like, who starts at chapter 14? Dang it. Anyway, we did. <laughs> um, and so looking at the syllabus, um, it's like all over the map. Like, we go from 14 to 26 to 2 to 10. Like, it's just all over the map. So if you do start early, just be prepared because... Sometimes that's not always going to work into your favor. Um, it certainly didn't work into mine. Although, I'll have it for when we do that chapter. I'll already have all that stuff together. Um, so, you know, I'm not too stressed about it. Um, speaking of which, if you're super stressed, it does weaken your immune system. I just learned that today. Um, and... So they say, if you're going to cry over it, you're going to make yourself sick or something. You know how the old saying goes, you know, if you don't quit crying, you're going to make yourself sick. <laughs> there is some truth in that. Um, so <laughs> we learned a lot today. We talked about um, viruses and micro, you know, just different type of microorganism, organ, microorganisms. I'll get it right here in a minute. Um, helmets, um, things that you study in microbiology. So this is really just a basic review of what was there. Um so, if you did fine in micro, you'll do fine um, in that, in that, in chapter 14, <laughs> wherever y'all come in at. Um, but anyway, so today was really just a, like a microbiology review for me. Um, and that was the very last class that I took last semester. So, I'm, I'm like, <laughs> yay! Uh, so, now it's just going home and learning terminology and um, then starting the math online. <laughs> Grr. <laughs> I'm not happy about that one, but <laughs> whatever. You know, I'll make it through. And they do have lots of resources at my university if you do struggle with math. Um, and they're, they're, the instructor that I have, uh, she's great because she's, she's just like, you know, get the right answer. I'm not going to critique you on every single thing that you write down as to how you got it you know, get the right answer. So, um, so that was relaxing.
for me. That was peaceful for me. Because sometimes, some people, some instructors will want you to do it their way. A, B, C, D, boom. And if you mess it up in any part of that step, you're out. Um, even if you did get the right answer. So I was very pleased that she was going to be that lenient with us. Because um, I think really in the real, real world, it doesn't matter anyway. As long as you're coming up with the right answer, you don't kill your patient, you're good. Don't matter how you got there. So, um, anyway, um, today we had a lot of free stuff on campus that was, you know, it was like welcome week here. So, um, that was nice. I was able to get another mask for free. <laughs> and, um, and now it's time to just go to work. And I noticed this morning um, that, you know, because I've been trying to prepare and I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that, and this is how I'm going to do, 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 you know, all these, all, I'm, this is what my daily routine is going to look like. And man, to do that mock run is super important. And I had, I had done the mock run, I thought. Um, you know, I had definitely charted my mileage, charted my time, figured in if there was a wreck or if this, because like I live in a big city. Um, well, pfft. No, let me take that back. Not compared to like Kansas City. <laughs> it's not that big. But um, so I live in a city that um, is rapidly growing and has been rapidly growing for quite some time for the last um, several years. And um, so traffic is just crazy in the morning. And there's another route that I could take. But, you know, taking like the side roads, the back roads, whatever you want to call them, um, to get to your destination, you're going to come into more bus routes, you know, because kids getting in and off the bus in the morning times and the evening times. Um, and then, you know, it's t two lane versus four or six lane, you know, there's not a lot of whole options, no, not a whole lot of options. I can't talk today. Um you know, as far as like, if you need to pass or whatever, if you get behind a tractor or whatever. Um, so I try to tend to stay towards the interstate. Um, so that when I travel, I, I kind of know, but I still, I was trying to figure anyway, the whole point of me telling you this, cause now I'm just rambling about nonsense, um, was I thought I had my routine down. Um, and today, this morning, even though I got here 30 minutes early, it wasn't what I wanted. It's not, you know, so it's those little tiny things that we have to, um, fine tune and get them done the first couple days. Um, because like what they're saying, so my hair, can you see these little wisps? Not acceptable. Not acceptable. I can't help it. I can't help it that my hair is like that. Like the little tiny thing right there. That's as far as it comes out. That's just, <laughs> I don't know. And my, my, my lady that fixes my hair, she's like, there's little wispies. Well, we're not allowed to have little wispies. Um, so they did tell us that we're going to have to use a lot of hair product or bobby pin our heads to death. Um, but they're super, super strict about our hair, um, cause it has to do with infection control. And, um, so I'm like, <laughs> you know, I shouldn't have to be worrying about my hair. I shouldn't, I like, it's up out of my, but no, they are, they are extremely strict in this program. And so, <laughs> so I'm gonna have to get that one figured out too. Cause if I put a headband over it, you're not allowed to touch it. Not once the whole time, the whole 10 hours that you're here, you're not allowed to touch it. That's impossible for me. I'm a toucher. <laughs> anyway. Um, Okay, so I'm just going to get off here. Oh my gosh, there's my friend. I got to say hello to her. Woo! Anyway, I'm going to get off of here and, and say hello to one of my good study buddies um, that didn't make it into the program this year, um, but love her to death. And um, y'all have a great day, and I might hop on here later and do some chats about what we're going to be studying and maybe have a little session with you guys. I don't know. Okay, talk to you later. Bye.